cooking apa? Hi, this is cooking apa? Preparing dinner for my family again. Uh, when was your last last time preparing dinner for your family? Why don't you do it tonight? Okay. Now, what I'm I'm doing a very common uh, Malaysian home dish. Um, this actually this is the uh, Chinese cabbage, and we have some uh, carrot sliced. Yeah. And just stir fry these two things together. That's it. It's a very simple um, uh, dish. And I have some ginger here, cut into a few slices, and some garlic oil. And we will need a bit of uh, oyster sauce. That's it. Right? Let's start cooking. All right. Let's put in some oil. I'm using some garlic oil. Okay. Okay. Toss in our ginger slices to sauté. Yeah. Uh, let's give it a bit of time because my oil is actually uh, cool because I took it out from my fridge. You give it like uh, we come back like thirty seconds later. Okay. Okay. As you can see here, my oil is heated up. Be careful when you are putting in your garlic oil at, uh, in, uh, initially because it may get burned, yeah? so uh, be careful on your heat. Now, when you are always using, when you are, whenever you are using uh, carrots, always you have to saute them first. Then only you can really get out the real flavor and bring out the sweet, the uh, nature sweetness from the carrot itself. Slowly, you are going to see the oil starts to turn orangey. Yeah, see, as you can see, it starts to turn orangey already, very fast. In Chinese, it's called the Hu Luo Bo Su. I don't know, is it called carrot beta? I'm not sure. Yeah, it's actually the nature sweetness from. Uh, from the carrot itself. See, the oil has changed color. I hope you can see clearly. See, beautiful color. Okay, you saute for it for a while. Then we can put in the Chinese cabbage. I'm not going to use a lot of uh, seasoning right here or rather I'm just going to use salt and a little bit of sugar plus um, the plus the uh, oyster sauce okay plus the oyster sauce and if you are a vegetarian there's actually a vegetarian oyster sauce Don't ask me how they made it, yeah, I'm, not, I'm, I'm not exactly sure. Okay, you can start seeing my veggie started to shrink. Now I'm going to give it a bit of hot water. Not too much. Some oyster sauce. Just to bring out the flavor, probably about one tablespoon. And let's give it a bit of salt. Wow, some a little bit of sugar. Okay. And some light soy sauce. A little bit. So we are going to get all the nature sweetness yeah, from the veggie itself. Carrot plus cabbage is a 
perfect match. Yeah, it's a match made in heaven. Okay, I'm on high hit right now. I'm going to cover this with a lid and we come back in about one, two minutes. One, once the veggie is softened, we will come back. Okay, this is after about one uh, one minute plus simmering under high heat. The veggie have softened. Not hundred percent softened, but that's the way we like it. Okay, we don't want. Usually Chinese don't. Uh, we pre always prefer to keep some nature crispiness from the veggie itself. So I'm off the fire right now. Let's give it some few dash of white pepper. A little bit, one or two drops of the uh, sesame oil. Right, done. Let me show you how I'm going to display this dish. Okay. All right, here's my stir fry cabbage with carrot. Hope you all like it. If you uh, like my video, do share my video on your Facebook to your friends. Come to Cooking About Facebook fan page to click above like and follow button. Follow up on the Instagram and. Uh, subscribe to Cooking Up our YouTube channel and don't forget to press the notification button. Yeah, bye bye.